Let's take a look at some fractions. All right, we're going to go with uh, how to add, subtract, multiply, and divide fractions. Um, Two-thirds plus one-fifth, right? So we have two different denominators, and we need to get the denominator the same so we can add. All right, so um, what we were looking at here is three times five is 15. That's going to be our denominator. So we have two-thirds times five over five equals 10 over 15. One-fifth times three, over three, is three fifteenths, all right? You add these two numbers together, 15 stays the same, 10 plus three is 13, 13 over 15, all right? 13 fifteenths, that would be our answer if we were gonna add. Now, what if we were gonna subtract these two, all right? So, Two thirds minus one fifth. All right? Basically doing the same thing. All right? So we know we just got this one to equal 10 fifteenths. All right? And we got this one to equal 3 fifteenths. So if you subtract them, 10 fifteenths minus 3 fifteenths equals 7 fifteenths. Right? So that's what we're doing. We added them, it was 13 fifteenths, subtract them. 7 fifteenths, exactly the same thing, needing to find the common denominator. Um, all right, what if we were going to multiply these? Uh, again, so we have 2 over 3 times 1 over 5. This is probably the most straightforward one where you don't have to find common denominator or anything. You can just go ahead and just multiply them out, and you will get 2 over 15 for that one. And then the final one. If you divide two thirds divided by one fifth. Okay, so when you're dividing fractions, we need to flip this and find the reciprocal. So, right, that means that it would be two thirds and then multiply. Two thirds times five over one equals ten thirds. And that's what we need to know about fractions.